when you're mega high key fucking tilted because you, your video stuff from a camera error and erase your mystery unboxing is me right now. But yeah, uh, so yeah, I just did the mystery unboxing. I didn't open all of it up, but like I unboxed it and then my camera got like a weird bug and then just wiped the footage. So uh, yeah, I'm just going to do an overview of what you get in the box or what I got in the box. I guess I'll do my little spew, uh, spew, spew. I did that first. Uh, here's the box. It's empty. That's pretty nice. Uh, but yeah, uh, I got the video game mystery box from Bluefin. Uh, it came with for third, third, certain Android 21. Which is why I got it. It was 80 bucks, so that's 60 right there. And then... All they really had to meet was 20 bucks, and then the rest of it was video games themed, which I love video games, as you probably can tell if you're a frequent viewer of the channel, just looking at me, I'm a gamer, I look like a gamer, I'll admit it. And so, like, I don't know, I if I get, like, a hundred dollars worth of stuff, and it's, like, video game stuff, I'll be pretty hyped. And, uh, yeah, so I got the box, and I got it today, and I opened it, and it was pretty hype, I'm not gonna lie, I actually pretty much enjoyed it. But, uh, it came with a lot of cool stuff, I'm gonna show it off, you got about six items. Uh, I can do the mystery. Oh, what did I get? Ooh, but I already told you. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to show it off. I'll talk about it, give you my final verdict, and tell you from the... It seems like they're going to keep doing this every month or so. I don't know if it's going to keep, like, the same couple scenes right now. Because this month, this is their, I guess, I think their first month's doing it. They had a video game box, a uh, villain's box, which had, like, the sandals figure, which is, uh, like, the one everyone knew you were going to get. And the, for the video game one, and once again, with Android 21, the Dragon Ball figure from Fighter Z. And then I don't know what it was in that, like a Power Ranger type of box, or it was like that kind of Japanese action show, Power Ranger, Kamen Rider type of show. So there was that, and I don't really know what the uh, special, this like specific figure everyone knew you were going to get from that. It might have been like the White Ranger, I'm pretty sure was in, or it was like the Green Ranger or something. That might have been it. Or like a common writer figure. I don't fucking know. And then... Oh, every one of these had like a special drop you could have got uh, for the video game box. It was like one of the com it was like one of the Comic-Con Storm Collectible Street Fighter figures. Which would have been cool to get. Uh, spoiler, I didn't get it. I kind of already knew. Because it wasn't that big of a box. I felt like it could fit a Storm Collectible. And all the other goodies and the figures. Because it didn't look that big. But hey, you never know. And then for the video... Or for the villain one, it was the... Uh, Revolver Tech Samurai Dude Vader, and then for the Power Ranger one, once again, I have no cl fucking clue. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna show off what I got. Uh, I guess let's talk about this. Uh, one I got first third in Andrew 21. Very happy to get this. Don't know the next time I'll be getting it. I say two yards because the next one I've pre ordered until like November, I believe. I mean, I have Goku, but like, I have to get it from Big Bad. I do not know when I need my next Big Bad ship now. So, yeah, this will hold me over for a bit. I'm very excited to get her. Uh, with it. Sold on her at first, but then the mystery box came around. It was decided to take a little gamble for a video wise. Uh, it seemed to not pay off because it wiped the footage. But you know, hopefully this will still do pretty good. And you guys will enjoy what you get in the box. Oh, I don't know if it says you get six items. I, I got no, yeah, six items. So it's pretty cool. Next item I unboxed was the one I was also very excited for. I see the video game figure that was like animeish figure. I guess no, there's more anime figures kind of in here, but uh. Yeah, I got this. Uh, I was actually really excited to get this because I have the Mega Man. I've had this Mega Man X figure for a while since Toy the Rest was closing. I wanted to get to Zero, but they did not have it when they were closing, so I never got them. So now I have the Zero to go along with it, so that's pretty cool. Uh, here's the back. That's the Mega Man I have, and I guess you can stack them on top of each other. Which I, I don't know why you do that. I'm just going to put them next to each other because it looks way better. And then you got three little blind box mystery boxes so i'm gonna show that off real quick if i can find where the one box one because i have no stinking glue right now where that i went that's pretty hype uh all right i guess i only have i'm fucking holding it i'm holding the box that i was looking for i'm losing it i've been at school like all day today and i just started school back up so i'm pretty tired because i wake up at like seven in the morning to drive to downtown detroit which is not fun it took like an hour and a half to get to my school downtown, and I wanted to die, and I'm very tired right now. And I've been at school for the past like 12 hours, but anyways, I got the, uh, this is the one I already opened on the video before it crashed, I got the uh, Monster Hunter figure, 
a little blind box. Here's what you got in it. And the one I got in it, which was the one I really did want, was the Calico, I believe they're called. It's a little Calico figure. Which, yeah, you know, this is a little cheapo figure, not even going to fret. But I do like Monster Hunter quite a bit. New expansion comes out, I believe, on Friday as of recording this. So that's pretty exciting. I might get it. I don't even decided yet. Because the Gears 5 also comes out that day. It's definitely top priority. But, oh, uh, yeah. It's a little cute. It's weirdly translucent. You can kind of see it on camera. It's like translucent for some reason. It's kind of like glass. But let me tell you, it's like cheap plastic. But it's it's pretty nice. I like it. Came with a little stand too. I already lost. So I have no idea I'm going to fucking stand it. Next up, the next one I got was another box I cannot find. Am I holding it? No. But uh, I'm going to do a quick cut just so I don't release the footage again. So it's going to be a little really weird cut, cut right now. So we're going to experience it together. Cut. All right. So, hey, if I do have this video again, it's chill. Next box, I can't find it. It was one that I predicted was going to be in this box. And it was one of the Mega Man blind box Mega Man figures. And I got that. And you could have got... I believe in it. I mean, I just opened it. I'm already not remembering, but I do remember now. You could got tr like a traditional Mega Man, Mega Man X figure, a Mega Man dot .exe figure, and the regular Mega Man figure, which is he which is like helmet off. So it's like his hair is coming out, and he comes this little like uh, service spot chibi, which is one I did want to get. And the other one I want to go with the Mega Man EXE figure. I'm happy to announce that I got no, I got one of them. I got the EXE figure. I haven't put them together yet. Because my video crashed right at this point. But I am really impressed with this. This is like all the new stuff we're going to experience together. I didn't show one of the stuff, I figures I got, which really makes it worth 80 bucks. So let's look at that last. But uh, yeah, got this. He's really cool looking. Uh, is there actually articulate? Which I'm actually kind of surprised. Like, decently articulated. I got that. I got the little blaster. And he comes with a couple hands, like a little punching hand or a grabby hand. Uh, like a hand or like a palmed out hand. His head which looks pretty good. Uh, got a little shield and then his like little sword. I guess I'll put them together real wicked lickety split. Did I just lose some of it? No, I didn't. Okay, cool. So, uh, yeah, uh, about a little bit about school. I guess why I put them together. Uh, it's going pretty well. I'm taking a game design class today. It was six hours long. I want to die. And I took a sound design class. I am a film major. So, yeah, but I wanted to take the game design class because I used to code games, if you did not know. I made a couple games. A uh, teacher destroyed my drive at making games, so that's why I'm now a film major. But my game design teacher at the school is a really good teacher because I had him before for he does all some of the film programs. So I have him again for six hours on Monday. But, uh, yeah, he's a really good teacher. Uh, so I decided to take it again because I need some, you know, some, like, random... Not pre-racks, but like, you know, like electives, I guess, yeah. So, how the fuck do you get this off? Okay. I think I just broke it. Did I? I hope not. No, it's good. I think. Nah, it looks fine. And, uh, yeah, that was pretty fun. I, why the fuck did I put that on? I found the box. So, uh, here's the box. And, yeah. I was pretty excited. These go for a little bit. Uh, I wanted to get one of these when Kudros was closing, and they did not have any, so I did not get any. Uh, I don't know how to fucking put this together, so we're just going to end it here. Is that right? I don't get it, so we're I'm, I'm going to fucking drop it there. Next up is the one I'm very excited for. I've been just eyeing this the whole second time I had to do this, and it was one mystery box I was super excited in the video to get, and it was the Splatoon mystery gun. I really wanted to pick some of these up, but they were like... 12 or 15 bucks at GameStop when I saw them like the one time and I'm not spending that much on a random little Splatoon weapon mystery box but I'm happy to get one of these in this crate because I really love Splatoon and just the design and characters and weapons. Uh, it's kind of sexist for Splatoon 2 it would seem like but uh they don't have the minigun or not the miniguns the uh Little Uzis, because that's what I use when I play online. But they do have the minigun, which is the one I'm hoping to get. But I really just like all these for the most part. Except, like, the Slosher is kind of like the one I would not want. Or, I think the classic gun would be pretty cool. But, yeah, I was open this, so there is still an unboxing in this. So, uh, here we go. Yeah, it's like, oh my god, these things are huge. Holy shit. 
Okay, I, you know, of course, it's classic. I said I wouldn't mind getting the classic if I did not get the minigun. And I did, so let's take a open this up and see what this comes with. These are, wow, these are actually kind of worth the money. I might have to go back and pick up another one or try and find someone online selling them. But, uh, wow, these are actually really nice and, like, big. Like, I can see, like, Hot Toys. This is, like, Hot Toy size. I feel like I could use these. But, yeah, so these would be, like, way small. And have, like, a really nice, like, little stand, it seems like. If I can get the stand off. Is there one thing that talks about these, like, mystery boxes? They're, like, in fucking plastic bags. This is a waste of plastic and, like, really just hard to open. I just dropped, like, something that I probably needed. And I kind of see the one. Oh, God damn it. I have like a nice part too. I said like Splatoon on it. Here it is. Uh, and then yeah, here's that part. So I'm gonna put this together real quick. This is probably awful now because the footage got lost. But you know, awful is the bottle. Oh, boom. What the fuck does this go? What the heck? Oh, I'm stupid. It's like the Gundam type of thing where they're like on the plastic and you have to like break them off yourself. So this will be this will cool on my desk, I'm not gonna fret. Then Okay, it does not want to stay. I don't have it on exactly like right it should seem like. Oh I have it on backward, that's why. There we go. So yeah, it says uh I guess the weapon in Japanese, Konichiwa. And, uh, yeah, it's translucent, it looks nice, it's really nicely detailed. I really want the minigun now, because it probably looks awesome. But, uh, yeah, I don't, so I think, yeah, I'm happy so far. And, but Peter, that's only five weapons, weapons, items, what's the sixth item? Good question, uh, one I was very excited to get. I did not expect to get another item in this cal caliber of, like, an SH figure. I saw people kind of annoyed. When they kind of teased it, because I guess this didn't sell too well, but as someone who doesn't have anything, and it's just whole, like, figure, like, company, or, like, line, even. I'm very excited to get it. It's a game I'm very dear and near to. I like this game a lot. That is a Mortal Kombat Storm Collectible Rain. I'm very excited to get one of these. I've heard really good things about them. I can't wait to mess with it after this video. I will do a more in-depth talk of the figure arts and the rain on my next hump video so I can showcase them off a bit better once I had some time to mess around with some and stuff but yeah this is a really nice figure they're bigger than I expected uh hopefully if I like this figure I feel like there's a good chance I'll be picking up the Marcus Phoenix because they're starting to do uh Gears of War figures which I love Gears of War and the NECA figures are complete ass so yeah I'm pretty excited to get that and that would be almost the end of it but I remember there's one last item I gotta show they sent me a little cute postcard so if you wanna read it there as a little thank you and then like it's like a QR code to their website so uh, yeah it's everything I got overall for $80 I think it's like 90 after shipping or something shipping and taxes like 90 bucks I am extremely extremely happy because I could let alone Android 21 I saw her at Barnes and Noble for 60 bucks. That's 60 right there. I'm guessing these go for like about 50 to 60, so we'll just say it's like 120. Hey, I'm already over what I paid for. Uh, the Splatoon gun, that's like 12 bucks, we'll just say 10. So that's 130. The Mega Man figure, I saw these for 10, which is why I didn't buy it, but I'm really happy to hold one now. So that's 130. I'll give like five to the little Monster Hunter figure because it's pretty shit. But it's still pretty cool as a Monster Hunter fan. So we're at 135. And I would just say 150. We'll just give this 15, give or take. So uh, yeah, I'm very excited about what I got. Uh, if they do, a, they, I'm guessing you're going to do one every month. I don't know if I brought that up. It seems like if you read the card. So uh, if they do another like video game type box. Or like a Dragon Ball or anime type of box. I might try and cop. But it really depends all what that guaranteed figure is. Something I'm looking for. Like if they do one in fall and it's like that like. The normal Brawly, because I did not get a chance to pre-order it. And it's like a, supposed to be like a common release figure. Wide release figure, but it's just not pre-orderable anywhere right now. Some person's talking outside my window. But I would definitely pick that up. And I'm really excited to see where these mystery bomb boxes go. Because I've been, for the longest time, looking for like a cool mystery toy type of blind box for this channel. Because I love these kind of blind box stuff. I watch them, and I hate the people that do them, but I like watching them for some reason. And uh, glad I could finally take part kind of before my camera took a shit. 
But yeah, I had a really good time. Uh, let me know, comment down below if you want to see me do more type of blind boxy videos. Uh, I will definitely hunt some more down and do them because I'm really happy with what I got here. And uh, comment down below what you got this week. I don't know if there's going to be an actual hunt video this week. As you know, school is a little bit hectic right now, getting back into the swing of stuff and trying to figure out like one time that I can go hunting and stuff. And I'm just kind of tired right now. Not even going to fret. So I'm going to end it here. Uh, remember to like, comment, subscribe down below. I already said that. And I'm going to go now and eat the pretzel that I've been staring at this past like 20 minutes. Because I'm starving and I want some salty pretzel goodness in my mouth. I burnt the top of my gums drinking hot chocolate today at school, so that's pretty hype.